causes lower back pain. Hi, my name is Olaf. I'm a licensed massage therapist who specializes in active isolated stretching. When you spend most of your day sitting or not moving, you are doing something and what you're doing is you're telling your muscles to, in a very, very small way, hold you tight. Have you ever sat down and then fell over? Well, that's what happens when your muscles fail. So your body naturally has a writing mechanism. It naturally has, a, has an ability to stand up straight or to sit up straight, and it will do anything it can to stop you from tipping over because that hurts when you hit the ground. In the case when you're in an office, your muscles, they just get tighter and tighter and tighter because everything is holding itself on at the, uh, up. At the same time, because it's holding you up, they are getting tired. And what happens when a muscle gets tired, it can't do its proper, proper job for the bone that it regulates. So in the lower back, which is regulated, which is governed by the hips, in the lower back, when the hips get tired, all of a sudden the lower back starts becoming coming a straight line instead of having that natural curve that it's supposed to have right here. And that natural curve is compromised when you sit. Some people are saying, and I've said this before, some people are saying that sitting is the new smoking. And it literally creates that much stress on your body. So if you have a ball, that's a good deal. Sit on the ball because that way you're governing where you are by your knees and by the strength in your legs. If you get, do it, can do a sit-stand desk, that will also help. The issue is the sitting. Figure out a way to do standing. So if you're working at home and there's nobody around, take your computer, pick it up, bring it to, bring it to the kitchen. It's a little bit higher there or take it somewhere else, put a box on there and then, and then sit there and type like this. You're standing, you're moving around. You see that I'm moving, I'm constantly moving. So when you're moving, you're not putting it into a, a situation where it's static. That's the main thing. Stop sitting, stop being non, stop not moving for a long period of time. That's how you're going to help yourself with your lower back. The lower back is the place that takes the brunt of everything that you do when you sit way too much. So give that a try. It's movement. Having said all this, I have put together a free ebook. That free ebook has some pictures in it and some descriptions. And those descriptions and pictures will, will teach you how to stretch the muscles in your legs. The website is stretchawaylowerbackpain.com forward slash free. It's also down below here. Subscribe to my channel. And if you want updates quickly on my next video, hit the bell icon. I just learned about the bell icon. The thing works. Get the, get the bell icon. That's it for your daily stretch break. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and I'll see you on the next video.